Hey guys, this is Steven from CE Performance here again for a short video on the 468. We just finished the dyno the other day, as you may have seen. If you haven't, check out the channel. You'll see the build up to the uh, final day where we dyno tested the 468 LSX. And we are beginning to do the installation here on the 1971 Chevy Nova. So what's coming out of the Nova is a 349LS aluminum block that we built a few years ago. It's going to be going into something else now. 468 is going in. Uh, we dyno tested the 468 on EFI. We're going to be putting it in the Nova simply with a carburetor just to get it back on the road. And then we'll do the uh, EFI conversion as time allows in the shop. So with the bore at 4.125, we were able to use an LS7 piston with that exact bore diameter and the compression height of 1.304. And with the short stroke, which is actually very short, it's only 3.267 inches. And then we have a connecting rod in here to make up the difference at 6.3 inch. So, um, it's kind of our goal to use parts that are off the shelf, not making it really expensive. So we want to try to make combinations that are unique, but using parts that are not unique, but put them together in a simple package. So this is a stock crankshaft. It actually came out of a, a work vehicle. It was off of a, like a three quarter ton van. And the engine block was out of a Cadillac Escalade engine came in as a core and we snatched it up to use for something like this. And of course the, the pistons are a little bit more expensive being they're forged, they're a bicycle piece. And the rods are from Eagle. But basically this short block is relatively inexpensive but using good parts to do it. Uh, on the top end we've got the AFR LS3 cylinder heads. They are the CNC ported version. 260cc intake runner I believe. And for camshaft, we're running a solid roller, and we've got solid roller lifters from top line that fit into the factory lifter trays. Okay, the cam specs. It is a custom grind from Comp. The duration on the intake is 249, and on the intake is 249, and the exhaust is 267. And the um, valve lift is 675, before the lash, and we've got them lashed at 16,000. Okay, so the cylinder heads came from AFR, but we changed the valve springs up to a set from PAC because the AFR did not um, actually offer a spring with enough spring pressure for what we we're doing. And um, we've got comp uh, chromoly rocker arms in it, they're 1.7 ratio. We had to actually make some guide plates fit because the valve spacing on the AFR heads are slightly different than kind of everybody else's. So we took the guide plates that um, came with these rockers and we actually had to spread them, cut them, put them back together. But it's run in the car for quite a while and uh, now we're actually just cleaning it up. It's going to a new customer and we're going to put it on the dyno and you'll see a dyno video coming up pretty soon on this one. So thank you very much for watching and uh, supporting the channel. We really appreciate that. Hope the stuff that we talk about and the dining videos and everything is entertaining. So share it with your friends and we look forward to doing some more. Thanks a lot.